So I just heard uh, Stephen A. Smith on first take, which I, I don't watch it, but once I get to work, I put my TV on, and of course it's on ESPN, so this is the, the rerunning of today's episode, which is Tuesday, what is it, September 19th, 2023. And I heard him talking about you, Jerry Jones saying he'll walk across coals of fire or whatever to help uh, magically melanators get into ownership in the NFL, which I don't believe it. He's he's been the he's been the Dallas Cowboys owner since what the late nineteen eighties, and he's never hired a, a black head coach. He's never showed any propensity to help any magically melanated, uh, even get some kind of level of promotion and management within his own organization. So we're supposed to believe that he's he he, he want to help the magically melanated get into NFL ownership, but of course, screaming a Smith gonna come out and defend him i believe him but yeah that after jim trotter came out and said the nfl uh, reporter said what jerry jones i think allegedly said that if magically melanated wanted to, wanted to uh own teams or whatever they need to go buy them or whatever he said then he goes on to say yeah jerry jones has done a lot for magically melanated yeah magically melanated that helped them win games that helped him win championships. But this is what get me about St Stephen A. Because he said, I talked to Jerry Jones and I told him this is what black people thinking. World, nation, St uh, Stephen A. Smith does not talk for magically melanated people. He's not the spokesperson. Talk to magically melanated people, especially magically melanated men like myself. He does not speak for us. So he needs to quit saying that he's not our spokesperson. We don't have one spokesperson. But of course he comes to Jerry Jones' defense. Of course he does, because that's what he does. But this video was for that. Stephen A. Smith is not the spokesperson for Magically Melanated. He's not. He keeps saying that, but he's not. A lot of Magically Melanated I know don't deal with him. Me and I know, especially here in Memphis and across the country. So he got to quit saying it. Don't let him fool y'all with that. He's not our spokesperson. Trust me. He has, he has popularity confused with importance. Just because you're popular doesn't mean you're important. So he's not our spokesperson. Let me say that again. He's not our spokesperson. And I don't believe Jerry Jones. I don't. But those are just are my thoughts.